Of course, this evening, we are learning more about the Port Arthur woman shot and killed by a police officer this morning. Investigators say 50-year-old Rosa Flores came at two officers with a knife. Port Arthur police say she had a history of mental health problems and minor assault charges. Fox 4's Haley Bull has the latest in our top story. Hi, yes, I'm in the 3800 block of 29th Street in Port Arthur. Behind me is the house where police say a woman was shot and killed by an officer after she came at them with a knife. Police responded to a 911 call for a family disturbance this morning. Investigators say when Officer Donald Suarez and Casey Frank arrived, Flores was holding a knife. Uh, during the course of the call, uh, one party was armed with a knife, refused to put it down. One officer deployed a taser to no avail. The knife was brandished towards the officers. That's when investigators say Officer Frank fired a single shot, striking Flores in the arm, holding the knife, and her chest. She was pronounced dead at the scene. We spoke with Flores' son, Luis Flores, who is the only person we've talked to telling a different story than police. Flora said they called police because his mom was feeling nervous, but that she never raised a knife. He did say his mom had a history of mental illness. Port Arthur police said this was not the first call made to the house. The chief of police said both officers involved in the shooting will be placed on administrative leave per police policy. Reporting live in Port Arthur, I'm Haley Bull, Fox 4 News. An autopsy has been ordered and the shooting is being investigated by the Port Arthur Police Internal Affairs Department and the Jefferson County District Attorney's Office.